So here I am in this hardware store trying to get some money out of an ATM machine. And there's this woman in front of me trying to do the same thing, except she doesn't know what she's doing. And she keeps making the same mistakes over and over again. And I'm trying to get money so I can get a cab and get where I want to go before it's too late. So she's standing there with a finger on the machine and a thumb up her ass while she and her friend try to figure out how this thing works. Based on the supposition that two half-ass brains are better than one, when in reality, two half-ass brains only makes more of a jackass. I personally think that they thought it was a television and were trying to get one of the soaps on it. But anyway, I'm standing in front of these two jackasses, and you know how hard it is to get a jackass to move. So I figure I'm the one who's got to make the move. So I walk out of the hardware store and across the street to a 24-hour deli I always go to because they have an ATM also. But their machine is out of order, so I say, fuck it. And I go outside and I call a cab on my cell phone. So I get this lady who asks me where I want to be picked up. And I tell her, the corner of 187th by Beaumont. And she says to me, what's the number on the building? And I tell her, lady, there is no building, only a street sign. She says to me, I need a building number. And I ask her, why? Are you picking up me or the building? She says to me, I can't send a cab unless you give me a number. So I say to her, lady, I'd like to give you some number too, but I don't want to get my hands dirty throwing it at you. So I tell her, forget about it. I'll flag down a cab in the street, which I wasn't too successful in doing because unconsciously I was using my middle finger.